Hey guys, what's up? It's Josh WRB here bringing you a brand new unboxing video because I re-upped for another year of horror block. Okay, I got one beef with nerd block. I had a one year subscription to horror block, but they didn't tell me in an email or anything that my one year subscription was over and that I was going to miss a month and that I had to re-up for another year. I wish there was an automated email that went out telling me that I had to re-sign up for another year because I would have and I wouldn't have missed last month and that I really didn't want to miss a month as I just love these things so much. So let's get into this being, I'm going to say this is January's horror block because I have no clue what month this actually is and it's January 6th I think right now when I'm recording this and that's when this came in the mail so I'm calling this January horrors block horror block because it's freaking January, people. Okay, let's break into this thing. <laughs> Alrighty. I like that it comes in the plastic because it is winter and the ch oh, and they changed the box too. I'm really excited about that as well. And I like that... Oh, wait, no, that sticker's on the bottom. So here's the new box. Hashtag horror block. I'm loving it. Same on all sides. Oh, it doesn't say uh, dead inside anymore. Ooh, the inside of the lid is really awesome, actually. So first off, we have ooh American Horror Story. I like, I like American Horror Story. That is my trusty knife. Oh no, styrofoam. It's my uh, kryptonite. Can't do styrofoam. Oh what? That's from. Frick, what is that? Asylum. I forget which American Horror Story that's from, but that is really cool. I think my wife will like that one as well. Next thing is, ooh, look at that pentagram. That's a dope box. Going with the candle theme, I think. This is, oh, it's a fake candle. I'll take that out and unwrap this. This is actually pretty sweet. Let's see. Oh, yeah. It actually feels like real wax. You won't be able to see that because of all the light that's on it, but it's actually flickering pretty nice. Next up, there's something here. Oh, a Nightmare on Elm Street flask. I love Freddy Krueger. He's my favorite character, I think, in all horror. But I, I think this is the thing that... Um, one of you were talking about in the comment section that was supposed to come in October's horror block, but something happened that they couldn't get them through customs. So I'm super excited that this has come now because when I got told that I potentially missed out on something Nightmare on Elm Street, I was oh, dope. Look at that. I don't even drink hard alcohol, uh, but this is really freaking cool i'm excited about this that's sweet i like that all right let's get to the t-shirt Ooh, ooh, gee ooh. that's that's not bad actually i'll wear that this month's rue morgue as usual which i'm happy about because i love checking what's coming up in theaters and stuff uh, Ooh, yeah splice are you guys excited to see Splice? Because I sure am. Here's a kind of flick through of the magazine for you guys. If you don't have a subscription to... Is there anything else left? To... Oh, frick, yes. Oh, is this a mouse pad? <gasps> Army of Darkness, if you don't know, is my other... Is, like, one of my favorite movies of all time not just horror in general i have like huge mouse mats but i'm putting this up on my wall as a poster because that is so sick that is january's or december i'm saying it's january's horror block for 2017 i'm so happy that i re-upped for another year because uh i like i'm wearing one of the shirts right now i wear these shirts all the time they fit so nice I bought a few shirts from Fright Rags and their art is 10 times better on their shirts, but their shirts that they print on are crap and they shrink and they bell out at the bottom and I never want to wear them. Even though they're my favorite prints that I own, they're the worst shirts that I own and I hate freaking wearing them. So either Fright Rags 
update your freaking shirts that you print on. I know you're never going to see this, but I'm just ranting about horror genre stuff. And yes, I'm super stoked on... Uh, this is one of my favorite blocks I think I've got in... in They've been stepping it up and I'm really happy about that. There you go. If you guys enjoyed this unboxing video, don't forget to hit that like button. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. We'll see you next time. Don't forget to click this video you see on the screen. You might actually like it. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Have a nice day, guys.